Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Ben the Human Plays Baldur's Gate 3. I have found the Susser Tree. You remember this quest we got, like, forever ago? Where it was, like, finish a masterwork weapon and we had to find the tree? Well, this thing with flowers all over it has some bark. And you can come wander over here from that hooked horror camp with the guy that we accidentally... Well, we didn't accidentally kill him. We definitely on purpose killed him. Um, but there's the bark. I've got the flowers and the Susser bark. Now I need somewhere to craft it. We need to go back to that blacksmith, I assume. Blacksmith's house should do. Yeah, in the in that that village at the very beginning. So we'll head back there sometime. But for now, why don't we climb down into whatever this place is? Down here we go. A lot of blood everywhere. Oh, oh, you're dead. <laughs> oh, right. Carlac, come get your lightning jabber. I, can't, I have the worst habit of leaving whatever thrown weapons I've given Carlac and just leaving them all over the place. I've already abandoned one magical spear. I think it was during the gith fight. Got left behind. Just a bottle. I've got a long All right, this place looks dangerous. Does my feet can carry me? Hello, anybody? Oh, <laughs> the game is saved for me. This is the Dread Hollow. Hold on. Everybody get low. Footwork. Hello. Oh. Ah! What is this? Run away! Everybody! Abandon ship! Carlac did like everybody's spread out. I don't know what the hell this is. There is work to Shadow Heart? Uh hide over here? You're still hidden somehow. I don't know why. And, you shall and then Gale back up. <laughs> I don't know what's gonna go on. What is this? Alright, here we go. Boom! What the hell is that thing? A bullet. He's not that scary. I mean, depending on if we can hit him or not. Let's see here. Before we forget... Let's bring Shadowheart and Gale into... Oh, you guys just rolled on over. Dang it, Gale! Bang! Nope, he saved. All right, you tried. Got to press on. All right, everybody's spread out. Karlak? My turn. You're a little wounded, but that's fine. Go ahead and rage. Oh, she can't jump when she rages. I forget. All right, just run in there. And then huck your spear that you just picked back up at him. 55, okay, he's got a high AC. Critical hit, yes! And then try again. Nice job! Uh, all right, that's good. Still breathing. Ben? Despite everything. Target outside of normal range. Well, get in normal Time to range. Press ahead. You absolute monkey. There we go, 60%. I'll take six damage. And a miss. Okay. Bust out your shield. Put him up. And turn. Got to keep fighting. Uh spread over here, I guess. And then Gale. What do we want you to do? We probably want you to use your like actual spells this time. Level three. Crown of Menace is not gonna help because it's a singular. enemy like they they won't go mad and attack their allies because they have none so our level threes are not going to do us much good we could try to hypnotic pattern it actually that's really high chance let's try it wish. oh i did not realize we accidentally caught carlac in there but he's he's been hypnotized heck yes he misses a turn now carlac can go crazy on him get him Mate. Uh, yes. Well done. Hit him again. Reckless attack. <sighs> Rats. Well, close with him. Time to push my luck again. And we've uh Blood found a secret. Well. Good job, me. Ah, rats. That's okay. What should I do? He's over halfway dead. So. Shadowheart, just drop another Sacred Flame on him. Eight is great, as they say. Dang, she's fast. Victory is assured. 
Lord. Okay. And now Gale, what is our level four spell that you just got? Do you not have any level four spells? I I don't think I set up your spell book, did I? Ah, I'm a moron. Ice Storm Blight would have been really nice, honestly. I think I'd probably drop Crown of... Oh, I can't do it right now. Um, Or, you know, I might drop Flaming Sphere. Mostly because that harms me every time I try to use it. Let's go ahead and use... Critical Hit. Two misses, unfortunately. But a Scorching Ray is great. He's down to 22 health. Incoming. Duck. Oh, Deadly Leap. He's going to land on Gale. Look out. Oh, nope, he landed on me. <laughs> oh, God, he did so much damage. And then he bit Carlac's legs off. All right, she's been acidited. Get him. Uh, Reckless attack. Oh, come on, Carlac. There we go. What to do? Awesome. Well done, team. Ooh, Blood Guzzler Garb. When an enemy damages the wearer, they gain one wrath. Hmm, is that useful? We'll pick it up, for sure. We've got the Lightning Jabber and the Javelin. Karlak, you pick those up. We've already looted you. You don't have any... You don't have any goods? Let's get going. You're just like a guy? I guess you have a dirt mound. Come over here. Dig up this dirt mound. Oh, there's a tombstone. Ah. Were you guarding your master's tomb? Found your treasure chest. Full of the elixir of fire resistance and a rotten tomato. And then some gold. Alright, well let's read the tombstone at least. The rock under your feet juts upwards, forming a perfectly engraved tombstone Is with it? a small epitaph. Uh -huh. In memory of Myrna, Myrna, a shining light in this dark world, may you forever gaze upon the lake you hmm. love to play in. Okay. Dig up the grave! Yes. <laughs> this couldn't backfire, possibly. Slowly exposed the skeleton. A large dog! A large dog wearing a chunky leather collar. Okay. Strange collar. It's got runes all over it. My collar now. Though I wonder what they mean. Oh, can we put that on Scratch? Oh, Scratch. I have a thing for you. Maybe. Perhaps. Or it's like a key. You see in this village down here? What the hell is this place? Is this the Durger, Dwerger r runes or something? Okay, we're coming back. We should probably rest, actually, now that I see. Uh, let's see. Gale, use your divine inspiration, my man. Level one. Oh, we must have already used that on our level three, then. Uh, before I forget, let's come back to the spells. Get rid of Flaming Sphere. Pick up Blight. And then... We probably won't use Witch Bolt ever again. Like, we could... We, we'd probably just use Ice Knife, honestly. And then we'll bust in the, uh... The, uh, Ice Storm. Last short rest. Looks pretty good. I rolled pretty terribly on, on the, the hit points there. All right, where are we going? Still no idea. Oh, we should go back and find Balin. I guess we're circling around here, so we can go back that way. I didn't realize we had kind of walked right by that. Dead Mykonids, okay. And a Dwerger. Mushroom bits, thank you. Dead Dwerger. You've got oil of diminution. Oh, that is thing I forgot. Uh, in D and D, Dwerger have like the ability to like make themselves huge. Like they're they're basically the size of dwarves, but they have like an innate ability to like go giant size. So they're like become the size of ogres. <laughs> and they like to swing hammers around and all sorts of things. Take the swarming toadstool. Pick up the cavern chasm creeper. All right, so we need to go check out Balin, which is down this way. So let's go down the knotted roots. 
but we've already explored the Dread Hollow. No need to worry about that. See if we can't find the dwarf that the gnome lady was looking for. Or was it a halfling? I think it was a gnome. Might have been a deep gnome. Alright, this place looks terrible. Ah, I found him! Uh... I don't want to set these off because I think it's going to kill him. Okay, hey, guy. Yes, I see them. Walk out of them. Bibber, what? Speak plainly, won't you? These mushrooms. Toxic. Okay. Scroll. Escape. My bag, please. I've dropped it somewhere. Uh huh. Hold tight, I will find your bag. Hold up a scroll of Misty Step. Thank you, thank you. I don't need to give him the scroll. Alright, you guys stay there. Where the hell is your bag? Is that the bag? No, that can't be the bag. Noble stock. Right away. Where is this bag? Anybody? There's a... Like a rug over here. Candles? Cup of oil. Candles? Is that like an altar? Interesting. I need that bag! I know! I don't know where it is, sir! Oh, there it is. Uh, okay. I've never used this before. But we're gonna use Mage Hand. Pick it up. No, 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 no. Mage hand. Bag. Grab. Can't be added to inventory. What do you mean? Hold on. Whoop. 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 There you go. You're welcome. Shaboom! Step forward. God. I can finally breathe. Can you, like, get out of the mushroom land, though? Or should I talk to you? Ah. Right. As, uh... What were you saying? I really wasn't. What are you doing down here? I went to quite some effort to helping you. The way I see it, you owe me. I'm at Dareth. She's waiting for you. I must... Need to go. Sure. For you. Your trouble. Yeah, no problem. Ta. Bye! Sweet. Scroll of invisibility? Absolutely. Let's bust all these mushrooms now that I'm not down in there. Like, I want to go in here. Or maybe there isn't anything in there. Oh, there they go! Kaboom! Might as well set them off all at once, huh? Jeez Louise! Uh... Do you think that's gonna fade? Or is that like... We're, we're boned forever to try and get in there. Hey, Karlak? Attention. Oh no, it's gone now. Hell yeah. Breathing. Look at that. Spine. We're so good at this game. Mind my we blew up every mushroom. There's a torch. I guess, yeah, if you walk in there and you set all that off, you're probably dead. Oh, we all failed survival. Rats. I bet there was a... A treasure chest in there or something. Cup of oil. I'll take the wine, though. Hold on. I don't want the candle. I want the wine. Give me the wine. No, don't talk to Shadowheart. I was hoping you'd come to chat. What do you need? <laughs> uh, we're doing good. Oh, maybe there is no wine. Is the candle worth anything, do you think? Oh, 
We've unlocked Vitriol of Loth's Candle. I don't even know where that is in my inventory anymore. Maybe that went into my... Um... Might have gone into my alchemy pouch now that I think about it. We'll take all the candles if we can turn them into something. There you go. Cool. Alright, we saved Balin. He gave us a potion or a scroll of invisibility for our troubles. Now. We'll we'll go back there eventually anyway. So we can speak with Dareth. But it looks like we want to go down this way. And there was some sort of village. So everybody come along. Go back this way. And then down this direction. And this is where we left off. Alrighty. Yep, there's the dead Dwerger that we uh, looted. Totally legitimately, by the way. Alright. Alright. Are there scouts around here? Anybody? Decrepit village. A camp. Looks abandoned. Hey, I can see a guy. His name is Lurgan. He is ambushing. Or are we ambushing Lurgan? Maybe we'll go back that way in a second. Swarming toadstool and rogue's morsel. Gather all the mushrooms. A signpost. The names of settlements are crossed out. Breachstone, Sinkhole, Salson, Lolf, Old Kel, Demons. Old Kel and Demons. I don't have any, like, quest indicators, so I'm, like, not really sure where to go. So we're just going to keep wandering until something shows up. Take this Bullywug Trumpet. I've been doing all of my, like, alchemy processing off-camera because it's just clicking a lot of buttons. But, man, after after we're done in the Underdark here, we're gonna have so much stuff to process into potions and whatnot. A dead Dwerger. Uh, I will take this. I don't need his cup, though. Corpses. These creatures did battle with Dwergar. They did, indeed. It's like you can leap across this mushroom chasm if you so choose. I don't know why you would. <laughs> uh, we could circle back around and kind of get back where we were before. Maybe I'll do that, like, separately on my own time. For now, let's just go, go back and, uh... Executed Deep No. That's a little messed up. More swarming toadstool. What happened here? Just a knife. Ooh! Short sword of first blood. Deals more damage to people that have all of their hit points. Okay. That's interesting. Could kind of go for like a two sword wielding build. Like, maybe you open with two swords and then switch to your shield or something crazy like that. Hey, Lurgan, I can see you. Can I talk to you? <laughs> Holvik. All right, let's talk to this guy. Hey, dude. What? Gek, got someone sneaking up on us. I was not sneaking. I walked up to you. <laughs> this got ourselves an infiltrator. It you move pretty quietly. Not quietly enough for my liking, though. Noise gets you eaten down here. Reckon I'll hush you. Oh, you want to fight? Something hungry comes along. His gnarled fist grips an axe. I will wreck your shit. I can be discreet. No plant. No need for bloodshed. Take your hand off that axe before you lose it. I could have killed you before you even noticed me, but didn't stand down. Obviously, we lean into our persuasion stat. Give us some guidance. Yeah, I was. we have a plus 12. Plus one, at least, from guidance. We would have had to roll a crit fail to fail that. Fine. I'll let you live. Thank you. But spoil my hunt, and you're dead. Who are you hunting? What are you doing? Told you. Hunting. Slave ran away. Took Sergeant Thrin's boots. Well, that's not 
What? Kill the slave and fetch back the leather. Or the bosses in Moonrise will have friends high. Oh, uh, so you work for Moonrise. Maybe I can help? Would you really kill someone for a pair of boots? Sergeant told me to. Wow. Besides, we're talking about a slave. Man, you are bad. Fine. Suppose I'll just eat you then. What? You bastards. All right, I'm gonna kick your ass right off of this this damn platform here. Target is blocked. What do you mean target is blocked? He's right there. Should I try to shove you? Hold on. Right. I'm trying to get to the point where I can push him off the platform. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, he just fell down? Well, that's not what I wanted to have happen. <laughs> I wanted to shove you all the way into the pit. I guess I should have blasted him with my thunder wave. Wait a minute. There we go. I was like, come on, let me down there. I want to hit him. 60% is pretty... Pretty high defense. Oh, you're almost dead, though. All right, Carla, get down here and kick some ass. Tactical. Uh, really? That, that would hurt you? Climb down the rope. Smack this dude in the face. Need a go ahead, Reckless. Oh man, he's got high AC. Right, we got him that time though. One down. Incoming Holvik. Oh man! Sonic Backlash. Critical hit. Get out of the fire, my man. All right. Uh, teach this dude a lesson. Melt him. That was dead. Alright, Gale's on fire. Not great. So is Shadowheart, but she has much more health than Gale does. Uh, and then let's Sacred Flame this nerd. Who? Where is the this other dude? Oh, he's so far away. Alright, just just get this guy. And then, uh, yeah, that's good. Incoming. Oh, no! That's not great. No, you come back here, you little bugger. <laughs> ah, that's what I was talking about. Look how beefy he is. Incoming Zomboids. Oh, ow, you punched me. How dare you? Stop it. Um, Vicious Mockery. Oh, he's got a lot of health, huh? All right, hold up. Karlak, you go first. Leap. Ouch. Do it again. Now hit him. Uh, do not react. Hit him again. Ooh, nice shot. Paralyzing critical. Once per long rat. When did you get that? Paralyze them, hell yeah. Now you can't do shit. Ender. So much for peace. Uh, Ben. Can you hit this guy? 84? If I can kill him, I think all the zombies will die. Dead. Nope. They are still very much alive. Alright, Ben, just get into range with them. Um, I think that'll help lock them down. And Gale, come over here. And torch. Who's got the lowest health? This guy? Oh, not quite. Enter. Alright. Shadowheart, finish this one off, hopefully. Good job. This guy's still got a long way to go. I take it back. He's almost here. Ah, man! What is with these guys? <laughs> Alright, Ben, go to town. Get him. Right, he's dead. Oh, he's not dead! Oh, because he's a zombie. He rolled He rolled successfully. Let's cut the fire, baby. All right, Karlak, come down here and kill this one, maybe? 
no need to react. Hit him harder. Man, they still they stay alive. They stay living. I don't fancy their chances. Burn. Good job. Ready. And then torch this guy. Oh, the zombie saved against the sacred flame. I'm astounded. Incoming. This is gonna hurt. Oh, she saved the, the lacerate at least. Oh, he didn't do anything. All right. Change your focus onto this dude. Critical hit is great. Hit him again. And then knock him off balance. Well done. Now, this is now Karlak, hit him hard. Uh, defensive attack. Hit him again. Man, they got like just enough to keep them alive. Not for long, though. And then let's deal with this guy. There we go. All gone. Find the missing boots. I'll take all that. I am encumbered. Let's, uh, instead, give these... Let's all just give this all to Karlak. She's a strong girl. The Shattered Dorger. I didn't do that, I don't think. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I didn't shatter that person. Let's give all that to Karlak as well. I'll take the scrolls. We'll we'll sort that out later. Give those to Gale, probably. Waypoint discovered! Heck yeah! I'm the Explorer General up in here. Exterminator's Axe! That has to go to Karlak for sure. I really like her defensive axe that she has right now. Going gem? Um, but I'll, I'll take a look at that and see if that's better. Fables of Faerun. Faded logbook. This seems important. Inside cover reads Burrow Warden Myrna. The pages are lined with neat calculations, equipment logs, and expedition notes. The final entry reads Backed after a 10 day in the northern quadrant, two potential mining sites scouted, discovered a vein of Erendur. Welso did a bang up job, organized shifts, and led the first dig. Brother or not, he'll be a great Burrow Warden one day. But he needs to keep his temper in check and the practice reading the stone. He's as blind as a surfacer sometimes. Planning to take him out later along the Ebon Lake to practice. Maybe we'll see them somewhere. Oh, we gotta look up this this dead dude here. Once again, just a bunch of stuff we're going to give to Karlak. Hold on. All right, just take it. Whatever. We're encumbered again. See, this is why I wanted to give it to Karlak. <laughs> How could you do this to me? Send... Carly. There we go. Yeah, we definitely need to go pay the, the merchants a visit here so we can sort out our inventory in the meantime. The Underdark Beach. An animated corpse. Very cool. I guess we go down? Shattered Dorger. Who did that? What did they get shattered by? Like, some must have stomped these fools. Rotting basket? Anything non-rotting in them? Nope, doesn't look like it. Blood smeared logbook. Maybe this will teach us. Detailing the appearance and quality of numerous gemstones that have been mined from the rock. Sure. Shattered Dorgar again. Uh-oh. Under... Underdark Dorgar boat. What creatures live in waters this dark? Hmm. Well, let's not take the boat yet. I don't know where that leads. <laughs> I don't want to go there. Water damaged letter. I'm trying to read you. And then some executed deep gnomes still. Dwarger are rumored to be prowling in the area. Well, they're definitely here. I don't want a shovel. What am I doing? Split. Yeet this. Drop item. We're just like right on the razor's edge of being over encumbered. I'll take that stuff. 
and Lacolite. We can pick up we can't pick up like a short sword, but we can definitely pick up like a giant crystal. Alright, up the rope ladder we go. Like we can keep going south here. And that probably circles back up with where we started from. Spattered diary. There's so much stuff around. It's in the burlap sack. Nothing. It's an anvil. A is for Azith. We've already seen that book. Oh, we should look at the diary. There. That's not what I wanted to read. Spattered diary. Badly charred with the property of Walbren written on the inside cover. Wonders if he'll ever see his friend Barkus again. I don't know if that's a name we're familiar with. Anybody know a Barkus? Could climb down onto the beach again. Sure. Let's see what's down here. Perception successful. What was that? Ooh! Hey, Ben. What the? Mage hand? What do you mean? You shouldn't have made me your enemy. Oh, not, not thunder. That's not mage hand. What do you mean must take a short rest? Are you kidding me? the golden necklace are those the boots half eaten apple think those are the boots I don't see any lost slaves down here they're just simple boots they must not be the boots Spoiled treacle tart. Okay, cool. Well, we've we've uh, explored this part of the map. If you guys enjoyed the... Oh, it looks like there's definitely more over there. If you guys enjoyed the episode, click the like button. It helps out a lot. We're going to keep exploring the Underdark next episode. So if you would like to see that, subscribe to the channel. That also helps me out a lot. But until next time, everybody, I hope you have a good one. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.